Hi guys, what's up, Jason here, and welcome back to a brand new FIFA 19 player review on my channel. So in today's video, guys, I'm going to be reviewing 84 rated player of the month, Sancho. Now, I was so excited when this card was released just because, you know, he's 84 rated, he's from the Bundesliga, and he's an English 5-star skiller. Um, this SPC is actually being removed at the moment just because he's meant to be a right mid, um, so they've removed him from the game. Um, so hopefully they will have this SPC back very, very soon. Um, I completed it for around 60,000 coins um, once I did get all the packs back, and it usually costs around 80 to 100,000 coins, and the reason it is so expensive is just because you do need a German in four and all the German informs are going for around 50,000 coins. So anyway, as you can see, he's got some really nice in-game stats, the 94 acceleration and the 88 sprint speed. He's also got some really nice dribbling stats and decent stamina at 81. So anyway, guys, this has been the in-game stats. Now let's get into the highlights. So now moving into the highlights for this 84 rated player of the month Sancho, now the first pro I could find on this card was his 95 agility, what is also his key stat, now agility on this game it basically determines how fast they can change direction and how quickly they do perform the skill moves, that's why I do feel it is like one of the most important in game stats when it comes down to scaling and just one of the most important in game stats in general because you know you've got a player with really low agility, they feel really slow and sluggish and they don't feel very good on the ball but Jadon Sancho is the complete opposite opposite of that this guy changes direction so quickly you know his back can be towards goal one second and then the next second he's facing towards goal through on goal and then his next throw is that really good acceleration so once you use that high agility to quit inside he can then use the acceleration to you know burst away from the defenders really quickly and it's really hard to keep up with him just because I think he has around 95 acceleration and he has really good sprint speed as well um, I think it's around 88 so you know you put those two things together this guy reaches his top speed so so quickly and you can definitely feel it in game and I really think it makes him great for scaling with and then the final pro I could find this card was his stamina now he has 81 stamina what is it very good um, especially if you're going to use this guy in foot champs you know if you want to use this play for the whole game um, if it goes like to extra time in towards the 120th minute you don't really need to worry about this guy's stamina he can run all game without getting tired and then the only really two cons I could find this card the first one was his strength um, and again you know it's expected with this card you know not really the strongest of players I mean he's not exactly the weakest he's not like Neymar but he's still pretty weak on the ball and then the only other con I found with this card was his three star weak foot and again it isn't the worst in the world but you know a four star weak foot would be a lot better so as you can see there we get a really nice goal we do the fake drag back then the goalie runs out and then we finesse it round him so anyway guys this has been the in-game stats let's get into the overview So now moving into the overview for 84 rated player of the month Sanchez, on the enjoyment scale I'm going to give him a 9 out of 10, one of my favourite cars I've used so far this FIFA and it's not just because you know he's English and because he's got the 5 star score moves, it really is just because this card is so so good for scaling with. The agility and the acceleration are just out of this world and if you haven't done this SBC yet you know even though it isn't out at the moment but when he is released I would 100% recommend to go and complete this SBC. On the competitiveness scale I'm going to give him a 7.5 out of 10. The reason it isn't any higher is just because of that physical is a bit low. He's got the 3 star weak foot and his finishing it isn't bad but it's not the best you know. Um, he's a bit inconsistent in front of goal at times. And then when it comes down to skilling I'm going to give this guy a 9.5 out of 10. Hands down one of my favourite 5 star skillers. I've used so far this FIFA and this guy if this guy gets a team of the season he's going to be so so good he have like 99 agility that shooting will finally get the upgrade it does deserve to probably around like mid 80s so that's why overall I've decided to give Jaden Sancho a 9 out of 10 so guys if you enjoyed this player review and want to see more FIFA 19 player reviews on my channel leave a like on the video and subscribe thanks for watching and see you next time